Let's go. 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 Let
what do we have here? Baby, do you want onions? Ang onion dito mura lang oh. 1 euro 99. Hey, times 60 ang to. Mga 120 pesos. Ang 1 kilogram. So not bad. Will you be able to carry this? And then garlic. No blanc. Walang maliliit. <laughs> si Austin. Galit na si Austin. Are you calling Dada? Are you okay? Let's get broccoli. Just one lang. This one. Hold that hand. Naka discount. Ang mga pasta. Did you see any pork belly? Are we getting chicken? No. What about chicken breast? Small chicken breast for salads. Kuha din tayo ng chicken wings. For ulam. Here in the deli section, kuha tayo ng palaman sa tinapay. I think this one's... Hmm... Where it is? I think this one. Let's get cheese for our salad. Tapos na kami guys. Di ako masyadong nakashare sa aming mga binili dahil si Austin naglalakad siya kanina. But yeah, maraming mga discount dito like mga yan, sabon, chocolates, and many, many more. And ito ang mga napamili namin pala. I'm not sure. I don't think this is enough for the week. But yeah, we have a bit. Where's your bread? What? We were not asked to pay. Ah, okay. I know. Deal. Tapos na kami. Nagbas lang kami pa uwi. Ayaw na daw kasi ni Karsten maglakad. Kaya nagbas kami. And dito naman na daan is sa likod to siya. Si Austin nag na. Yan o. Ayaw niya na. But malapit naman na. So, di na lang namin siya pa kunin or palakarin. I don't know about cars then. Hi everybody! We are now back. So, nagbas na nga kami, no? And we are here immediately. Ito ang ating mga napamili. Let me check Dobby the spaghetti kung tama ba ang ating na. It's actually very big. Oh, one kilogram. Mm -hmm. And then, did you have the receipt or you did not get it? No, you always do not get it. Uh, this is correct size, guys. Spaghetti. Yay! Nakuha lang natin ng discount. So, we can make spaghetti as as much as we want. But wala naman akong sauce. We will just See, si Carson, how we can get the sauce. We can get the two milk. When we eat Austin, I was going to eat the rice. I'm going to get the rice from Austin because the rice is gemuse and hunchen with noodles. Gemuse and hunchen with noodles. So, vegetables and chicken with noodles. We can put the rice in the rice. So, it depends. Chocolate drinks. I always like to drink that. Garlic, butter, snack ni Austin na strawberry. Para siya na dry na strawberry. And then we also have this um, salad na meron pang roots. This is actually cheaper than when you buy like uh, like this baby na. No? But kung bibili ka naman ng isang pack, meron na siyang carrots. 
and different kinds of salad. But for this one, meron siyang, I don't know, we will see kung masarap ba. And then, isang tinapay ni Austin na breakfast. Kinuha ng maingay si Austin. And then, palaman sa ating tinapay, meron pa naman tayong tinapay. Cheese for when we're cooking and as well as for our salad. Broccoli para sa lugaw ni Austin. Chicken na breast para sa siguro lugaw ni Austin. Or like ulam or para sa salad. We also have carrots. So while we're putting out the grocery, merong nag-question sa atin na subscriber asking kung paano ba mag-apply or paano ba magkaroon ng online job or work from home. So the best way to do that is to apply to the websites na nag-offer ng work from home, Upwork, onlinejobs.ph, LinkedIn, and other websites as well that are available kung siguro magsa-search kayo sa Facebook. Freelancer groups, try to join that and you will get some ideas kung kung saan pwede mag-apply ng work. Ang sa akin kasi is hindi ako dumaan sa process na nag-apply ako ng work because my good friend Jenny is the one who gave me the job. Yun yung time na pandemic pa at first. And then when I had my German language course, nag-stop muna ako sa work. And then, after a while, nag-transfer siya sa different company. Nag <laughs> Sinama niya din ako doon. So, I was just very lucky to be given that opportunity. But I also wanted to suggest na if you are looking for an online job, maybe you can try to work on the skills and maybe know the skills that you can offer. Because kung mag-a-apply ko yun ng work from home, is that minimal training lang ang mabibigay sa inyo. So you have to ask yourself, saan ba akong magaling? Am I good in social media marketing? Am I good in like customer service kasi most of the work from home na talagang makakapasok ka or makukuha mo immediately is gonna be a customer service. With that, kailangan mo mag-accept ng calls or if not chat but mostly calls. So, ask yourself if you are something na kaya mong gawin yun because for me, if ako is that gagawa ko ng work na may call, hindi siya pwede. Pwede lang siya because... Uh, sometimes, I'm just doing some meetings and my boss is aware na meron talaga akong baby. But this is just a part-time. Yeah, that's also you, what you need to consider. The time that you can offer kung kaya mo bang mag-full-time and mag-part-time. And for me, since I do have a baby, part-time lang ang kinakaya ko. Even though sometimes nakaka-work ako ng like whole day, I would still consider myself talaga as part-time because kailangan ko pa rin mag-offer ng time kay Austin. And then, hugasan ko na lang muna itong chicken, no? And then, i-divide natin. And then, after, wait lang. So, after alam mo na kung anong skills na pwede mo i-offer, is that, mag-try ka na ng apply. One good tip is not to expect immediately na on your first try is that meron ka na makukuhang clients because even as for me, I remember nung times na nagsistart pa lang ako not even work from home, but nung nagtatry pa lang ako mag-apply ng trabaho ba, hindi talaga ako natanggap because they consider or I think I'm not really so good at English or communication skills. Talagang importante yun kasi nag-apply ako ng call center before and hindi ako natanggap ba because I'm really not so good at English. A process na kailangan mong ang pagdaanan. Kailangan mong mag, maka, kailangan mong makareceive na rejection. But if you are something that is quite good, so good for you. Di ba? Although when it comes to disadvantage, ang isang napapansin ko is that if you're a freelancer, you're not employed by the company kasi hindi ka employee kasi freelancer ka. You can do whatever you like or I think it's also like um, kung hindi nila magusuhan ang work mo is that pwede ka nilang tanggap, tanggalin because freelancer but I'm not so sure ha um, I believe hindi naman ganyan ang mga clients but another is that you have to process your own taxes you have to process your own health insurance for example gusto mong mag um, maghulog ng SSS, ikaw ang maghulog niyan by yourself. Kung gusto mo ng PhilHealth, 
Ang pag-ibig, ikaw maghuhulog niya. But, it's also easy to do it anyway. So, yeah. Tignan nyo na lang. Kung ayaw nyo naman, okay lang po dito. Walang problema. This is how their chicken wings looks like. May pinutol sila na part ba? Yung maliit na part. Yun pa naman ang masarap na. Yung parang buto na ba? Tinanggal nila. Chaka. Anyways, okay lang naman. Nandun kami sa little um, nagbili because yun ang mas marami ang options for meat. Marami din discount. Marami mga ang mga. But hindi kami masyadong nagbili because priority namin is mga ulam. Later on na lang ang mga snacks na. Then, agay! Saan naman eh? Kaon dek kakan on. Kaon kakan on. Krap? Hmm? Krap? Nag-eat naman ang bread. Wait for mama and papa ha. Mag-finish ha. Nakain na si Austin ng konti guys. And then after eating, si Austin naman. Nag-milk na siya. Nag-bread na siya. And then kami kakain konti. And then si Karsten. Ah, si Austin naman pala.